Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. For those of you that do not know me, my name is Excel, you guys. Um, today I'm gonna do a makeup tutorial. Um, I wanted to try a cranberry maroon look with some gold glitter, because I found this gold glitter in my drawer. So I was like, why not? And it's from J-Cat, I think. Yeah, it's, it's from J-Cat. I think this brand, they have it at Ulta. I'm not too sure. I don't even remember buying this, to be honest. Um, maybe a friend gave it to me. I don't even know. I don't even know how I got it, it got in my drawer. So I want to test it out. And if you saw my Ulta haul, you saw that I got some Ulta Beauty Glitter Glitterazzi eyeliners. So I am going to try this and then like put this on top. So I'm going to try that. And yeah, let's get to it. I already started with my brows, you guys. Make sure you don't you do not forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna I'm making a giveaway, you guys. Once I hit 1k, I will pick five winners. Five winner, 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 chicken dinners. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna prime my eyelids. You guys, I'm so hot. Um, this sweater is like super freaking hot. I'm gonna prime my eyelids. Hold on, you guys. I'm gonna turn on the fan real quick. Hold on. Excuse my fan, you guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm like really hot right now. And I'm not feeling this sweater. I like want to change, but I'm doing this for the video. So first, first, you guys, I'm going to prime my eyelids. Like I said, I am going to use the e.l.f. Camo Concealer, which it looks like this. So let's conceal. And I like getting a brush, you guys, any brush. I always use my Wet n Wild eyeshadow brushes. But any brush um, will work. So. So after I prime my lids, you guys, I'm going to go in with the Hit the Lights palette. Um, we're going to use the shades in the bottom, which are these cranberries, these two. And then I am going to use this middle one right here. So let's see how this goes, you guys. Let me get uh, another brush real quick. I'm gonna get the Wet n Wild um, eyeshadow brush. <clears throat> and I'm gonna place that dark color. Oh, that's really pigmented, you guys. This palette. You guys, it's so, so pigmented. I'm not even lying. Like, I freaking love it. I'm just going to pack it first. I'm going to pack it in first. And then I'm going to blend, you guys. So it looks a little bit harsh. You know what? Let me zoom you in a little bit. You can see. Ah! Ah! there you go okay so i'm gonna pack it like i said and then i'm gonna blend and it looks purpley on camera but i swear it's like maroon you'll see in the pictures once i post it on my instagram you guys and make sure you show some love over there I am gonna get this color on top you guys oh my gosh right here the very top one the very first row and the third color I have I actually have the names of the eyeshadows but it's in the floor and I want to get it it's a little paper that's in the the front of the palette whenever you open it the little plastic there I can see the names there but I don't want to get it so I'm going to get that color and blend it with the other color we put first. Just so we can blend all those harsh lines, you guys. Because blending is key. I always tell you that. It doesn't matter what color, what colors you play with. I've learned that. That any type of color you play with, you must blend. But you just have to be careful what type of color it is. Because if it's like super dark like this one and super pigmented yet yeah, you need to go 
slowly and build it up slowly. Because if not, it'll be a disaster. But yeah, you get the point, you guys. I want to finish the other eye just because I don't want to take a lot of time. So I'll be right back. I'm just going to blend the other eye real quick. You guys, now I'm adding this uh, dark brown right here. Well, it's like a dark burgundy. And you can see it on camera. I think it is catching the color. I am adding that to just the crease, just to deepen it up a little bit. And you guys, I'm not perfect. This eye might have a bunch of eyeshadow. This eye might not. I'm not perfect. I am not trying to be perfect. This is just what I do and what I know. Um, so a disclaimer for that. So I'm just deepen, deepen. There. Just gonna add a little bit more, you guys. And then right now I am gonna cut my crease and then we're gonna play with the glitter. Wow, it's looking really beautiful, you guys. And I'm getting that first color, that little purpley one. I always say little. <laughs> um, since I'm little, like everything's little for me. And yeah. Now I am going to blend all these colors together. So I'm going to get a clean brush. I'm gonna get this Morphe PK5, what? Yeah, PK524. Looks just like that. And it does not have any product, you guys. It does not have anything. I'm just gonna blend everything together right here in the top. Just because I don't want any harsh lines. Okay, there. Now I am going to cut my crease. I don't know if my camera is catching that, but it looks so beautiful in the mirror, you guys. It looks really pretty. I promise I will come through like I always do, you guys. So let me cut my crease real quick, guys, because I do take... I don't take long with cutting my crease, but I like to perfect it. I want, I want to make sure I am doing it right. And since I have like a bad angle with the camera and the mirror right here, so I am gonna cut the crease real quick, you guys, and then I'll be back. I will not take long, I promise. Okay, you guys, so I am done. I know it does not look perfect, but I promise it looks really nice. I'm gonna do, um, I'm gonna put some glitter glitter glue where is it so it's right here i'm gonna put some glitter glue you guys i'm gonna be using the Too faced glitter glue you guys i've had this for forever and i do not know if it's good what well, seems good i don't know okay so i'm gonna just apply that where i kind of cut creased for the glitter to stick Yeah, I'm just gonna do one eye at a time. So. Oh my god, what am I doing? Okay, I think I put a lot. <laughs> but it's okay. Okay, 
Okay, let me put the glitter. And it's loose glitter, you guys. I don't know where to put it, though. So I'm just going to put it, like, in this little um, thing, the little, the little tin cap. I'm just going to put it there, you guys. Wow, this is so pretty. Oh. Look, you guys, how pretty. Oh, wow. I think I need more glitter glue. Oh, this is so pretty. And I want to skip like where the lashes are gonna go like right here in the very bottom Because sometimes lashes can, will not stick Wow, this is so pretty you guys Look how glittery Oh my god Okay, you guys, so I finished with my other eye and then I went in with, with uh, falsies. I am using the ColourPop in the style Mommy. I do have them on. I don't know if you can see them. But the, the, like this side is like, it's not cooperating at all. But yeah, you guys, I'm going to start with my face now. I am going to go in with my Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. You guys, I love this primer. I will not, not, not change it for anything. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in with my foundation. The foundation I'm using and that I've been using is um, the Superstay Maybelline foundation, which is this one. You guys, I love this foundation so freaking much. I love it. I love it. And I only do two pumps, you guys. That's it. I love 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 this foundation and I do try to avoid like my under eye area just because I am gonna go in with concealer you guys I think with one pump you should get your whole face but oh, I like full coverage foundations and this is like one of them and it's really cheap you guys And I love it. If you have not tried it, you guys, you're missing out. And it's from Walmart. You know how they say that um, high-end is always better just because they're high-end? But in reality, there's a lot of hidden gems out there, especially at Walmart and Target. Like, you don't have to necessarily buy... A high-end foundation for it to be very good like there's a lot of foundations out there that are really 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 good like for example this one I love 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 this foundation and I've been using it a lot a lot a lot like I just I recently bought the Marc Jacobs foundation you guys and I don't love it as much as I thought I was gonna like it but I do like it just for on the go like to like cover any acne or whatever like you know but this is the way to go i love this foundation i love it i love it and i know it looks a little bit light but i am gonna go in with bronzer so do not worry so let me go in with a brush right here like in my t-zone just because um The sponge cannot reach there. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with concealer. Oh my god, I look crazy. <laughs> oh, to see your subscribers? I have to record for both. Oh, yeah. Okay, you guys, so right here, I do go in like this where the shadow is at. Like, I do draw like a little, I mean, I carve it. I love love this sponge. It's from Juno. Juno and Co. or C O something like that, you guys. And I want to make an order of these sponges. They're so badass. 
<laughs> it's weird how we make different faces, right? Whenever you're doing your makeup. When especially with mascara, when I used to wear mascara back in like in high school, I used to go like to get all my little hairs. And to be honest, I don't even use mascara. I don't like mascara anymore. Like no more. Plus, it doesn't even make like my my eyelashes are short. I guess that's why I don't like mascara. Cause even though if I use it, like my lashes are not gonna show. Oh, I need to go in with a brush right here. Hey, keep it down, you guys. Okay, let me get the brush that I was using right now. Let's blend all the concealer. Okay, now you guys, I'm gonna bronze my face with the butter bronzer con concealer. <laughs> with the butter bronzer um positions formula butter bronzer oh my god i cannot talk <laughs> and right now i do not have setting powder you guys i ran out of my laura Mercier powder so i do not know what i'm gonna set with i'm just gonna leave it like this <laughs> and just bronze because i do not have any setting powder you watch people guys watch people view yeah I watch other people's videos. Yes. And you copy to get more subscribers and copy them. How am no. I going to copy them? To get more subscribers. I can't copy nobody. No, because you No. No. Hey, you need to keep it down. Big ones, not little ones. Like five people or six. You guys, I love this bronzer. This is my favorite, favorite bronzer ever. What the heck? If you have not picked it up you have to pick it up it makes you look like tanned i don't know like it like if you just got here from the beach you're <laughs> funny hey you need to be quiet mind your own business i'm gonna go in with my nose because i don't like my wide fat nose <laughs> There you guys. And I am going to go in with blush. The blush I'm going to use okay. is... The blush I'm going to use is... The Anastasia... Um, the blush trio. This one right here. smile and then I am gonna spray my face yeah. with the Mario Badescu skin care setting spray it's actually just facial spray but everybody uses it for I guess setting spray but I'm gonna use it for highlighter to put my highlighter And I will spray more if I need more. Just because I love that. Um, how do you say it? That wet effect. I love it. Oh, you guys. This is so beautiful. And I'm gonna put some in my brow bone. Ah, se me fue la mano. And I'm gonna put some in my inner corner. Oh. 
You guys, who doesn't love highlight? This is my favorite part. I love, love, love highlighter. What's your favorite? You guys do not mind my kids. They're here with me. That's why. <laughs> then I'm going to do my lips. I'm going to do like a very dark vampy uh, lip. You guys, I'm going to go in with this Wet n Wild gel lip liner and um, plum together, which it looks like this. It's like a burgundy dark maroon color. And then I am going to put this gloss on top so let's see how that goes let me line my lips you guys i don't like my top lips just because they're like super como picudos i hate them okay you guys so i did finish my lower line um, I am going to go in with the gloss that I told you, the Kylie one. I already lined my lips as well. Oh, this is really dark. But I like it. There you guys. There, how pretty. Que bonito, I love it. I love this. <laughs> well, that was it, you guys. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys liked this tutorial. It didn't come out perfect. Like I said, I'm not perfect. There you go, guys. hope you guys liked this tutorial like i said i'm not perfect you guys i'm not trying to be perfect i just like to show you guys my way of doing makeup everybody has their own way um but i just wanted to share i just like to share with you guys how i do my makeup but i love it it came out super cute you guys if you want more videos like this like these um, comment down below if you want more videos like these. I will make different looks if you guys are interested. Um, but yeah. I hope you guys like this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Comment your thoughts. And make sure to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget about the giveaway, you guys. Once we reach 1K, I'm going to do the giveaway. And there's going to be five winners, girls. Five winners. And make sure you're following me on social media because on Instagram, I will announce the winners from the 1K giveaway. So make sure you are following me there. And that is it for this video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. See you in my next video. Bye.